The Oh Snap, Snap for Lux. The marketing got me good. I bought one. These are my thoughts. As a phone grip, it works okay. So you'll see the main way to get it open is you press down on this little thing here and it pops it open. It'll pop up like this. This is what it looks like. You'll notice it looks just sort of like just kind of cheapo plastic because it is just cheapo plastic. It's thin, it's sharp, and if you don't get it just right on your fingers, you poke the edges here and it is everything sort of thin and sharp, but that's kind of what it's got going for it. This is the first pop socket or phone grip, not pop, the versus the pop socket. It doesn't catch on to anything. It really is ultra thin, ultra flat, and that's the biggest reason I got it. I tried to use a pop socket for a while. It always just grabbed and snagged, but what the pop socket has going for it is just, you slide with a pop socket, you slide your fingers in so much easier. This one, you kind of have to work your way around, make sure you're getting just under it, just so, just right. You'll notice that it is very spinny, very loose, which is a good, like it's a positive thing as far as rotating it in your hands. But the, the socket itself, like I said, it's sharp and the plastic feels like it's gonna break. They say that you can, that it's durable and that it is strong, I haven't had any issues with durability, but I just know that when I'm trying to like pop it open like this, you'll see how fast and easy that was. But sometimes if it's just not right and you're trying to, and you're playing on your phone and you push the button over here and you try to, that was a good example. So now I'm, I'm kind of hung up on it and then you got to rotate it and get it just right. You don't run into that issue with the pop socket at all. The price is, uh, 40 bucks, they are $40, so they're not cheap. For a pop socket, I'm thinking a pop socket for like 15. But the thinness, also the magnetic part is super duper strong. I mean like, like just crazy strong. It's not coming off, I'm not, I've got all my computer expensive stuff around me, it doesn't come off. Very strong, um, but if you're charging it, you have to have a clip on kind of charge because if you just have like the flat kind of open charging where it's just coming straight through and your phone, it has to be in a certain spot. It has a hard time connecting to those type of wireless chargers. It's got a snap on, but the magnet's strong. You can pop it on any metal thing, whatever, and it works really well. You can do different cool little features. It's got this little kickstand feature to where it, you know, it sits, it, pops itself up. I've used it a few times. Usually I actually use this feature if I'm like sitting on the couch and I don't want to hold my phone, I'll just kind of set it on the back of my hand and rest it like this. That way I don't have to like hold the phone. Um, I can just set it here and be extra lazy. That's how I will use it. It's a good little, it's a good little phone grip. And uh, if you got 40 bucks to spend, I recommend it for sure over something like a pock socket, just because like I said, pop socket catching on my pocket all the time. If you're in the market for a phone grip and you want something that is ultra slim, that works pretty decent, but is difficult, it's more, it's not like it's hard to get in there, but it's more difficult than it feels like it should be when it comes to a phone grip. It feels like like that. Like you run into this, like you'll kind of come over and then you'll come underneath it and you can, I mean, you can, you can slide your fingers straight in, but it just takes a little bit more like, effort and focus when it feels like you should just be able to slip your hand in there easy peasy, but it definitely takes a little bit more effort to try and get your fingers behind it, but it works fine. It's strong, does all the stuff. That's it for this one. This is pretty short, pretty easy. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. I'll try and answer them for you. I'm trying to hit a thousand subs. If you would help me, that would be great. If you don't though, thanks for at least watching my video. Appreciate you. Have a good day. See ya.